Right, here we go. It's the uh, start of March, and this is our March blog, and we start season, uh, what, two weeks up there, Jake, don't we? So, yeah. do there. So, the Tamak car is on its wheels. Jake's just got on its wheels, literally just 10 minutes ago. So, come to the end of our working day now. We've had enough. Uh, shower car, Jake? Nothing, just needs setting up. Um, yeah. Scales. Yeah, we'll get mine up. Mine's ready now, so mine's painted and uh, oil change is done. So mine can come off the ramp and, and the scales are on this ramp, you see. This is uh, where we weigh the car. So it's easier when it's on the ramp. So mine can come off the ramp, can't it? And yours can go on. Uh, and I'll paint your bumpers from there for you. Yep. What else have we got to say? Anything? No, no, no. no. Uh, the coach is inside because we're doing a bit of work on the coach, just stacking it out ready. Uh, starting to put oils in and starting to get all our storage and all our spares in. Uh, we're getting there, we had a good start. Had a good start, haven't we, mate? Yeah. And then we'll see how the uh, car's looking next week. Righto. Yeah, one week to go, we're nearly there. One week and we're uh, starting the season this time uh, next week. It's uh, Friday night now, so we're just finishing, or we've just finished rather, just working on tyres. Tyres are our next problem because tyres are our biggest pain. Um, can't get tyres at the moment, just can't get tyres. I've managed to speak to the guy in Holland because I'm a registered dealer. Paid 147 quid per tyre, I managed to get seven tyres. Spoke to Mark Gilbank, he's got some tyres, he hasn't got all I want and the guys in Holland have not got all I want either. But we managed to get seven, we could do with, uh, we need seven to start, which is um, three on this car. Uh, Time my car, two on the shower car and two on the other shower car, so that makes seven. So we'll start with new tyres, and then we need another four for this car as well. So we need, really need 11, but seven tyres were over a grand, so we need to cut back on tyres, and that's without the cost of fuel that's just gone up today. So I'm looking at trying to buy a fuel tank at the minute, because I spoke to Mick Harris last week, and Mick suggested I'd get another, uh, I've got a red diesel tank for our motors and tractors, but I could do with a, he said, why don't you get one for white diesel? Yeah, good idea, Mick, so I'm, I'm trying to get a tank at the minute. Um, so that's our update for the for the uh, current state of affairs. Uh, this car's all but done. Took up put the engine in and uh, sign right is booked. And uh, licenses have turned up today. So about there really. Just this time next week we'll be loaded up and uh, getting ready to get the Kings in. Start the season. Watching the others championship first race. So I think I'm row 11. So exciting to start the season. Give me a bit of enthusiasm to get going really because all of a sudden I'm, uh, I'm in a big race, so good, good way to start the season. Can't wait, it's, it's chucking down rain now, so I hope we stop raining by this time next week. Righto, do another update at the end of the week when we're ready, and we're loading, in, and uh, that'll be it, and we'll be starting the season. Bye. Uh, coach is getting there, lights are working now, cabinets are in, starting to stock, and uh, workbench is in, starting to stock everything now. We're getting there, we're getting there. We're going to reorganise this year. Just a few more bits to do, and uh, I have to put new new uh, rams on these because they wouldn't lift high enough. Now they're too strong because they're not new. Um, yeah, pleased, pleased, very pleased. Got to finish this week. Well, got it in next week. A few more lights on the door. It's never ending. Well, it's Monday and we're racing on Saturday. This is our last week of getting ready to race and uh, we're trying to start the cars. Mine won't start. We've had it running since Christmas, so we've uh, just put the battery back on charge again now. It's just been stood for a long time. Jake's going to get his out now to give us a drive. I'm um, just uh, meddling with the coach, just getting everything loaded and uh, tools and spares. And we've got, we're more organised now than we've ever been. We've got spare nine inch. Uh, uh, not for a spare nine inch dip and spare gearboxes and spares. We've got organised, everything's labelled up and inside's the same. I'm really, really, well, a bit of a mess at the moment, but everything's locked up. Shocks, stubs, and props, and steering, and what's it say over there? And then we've got. Uh, brakes and pipes and starters and assorted. So we're getting there and we're more organised this year than ever. And uh, if anybody is in stock and needs to borrow stuff, absolutely most welcome. Just come over and see us or come and borrow it. Absolutely more than happy to offer anyone at to meet you. We all want to race against each other. There you go, he's got that one going. So it is started. So uh, I'll get mine going in a minute. 
and uh, this is our week to get done. He's going, he can only get more and go in a minute. Yep, works work. Well, right, Grant's just done the lights, so the lights are done. Spares are getting there. Oh, I'm just getting there every day. Every day's getting better. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Really getting there. <laughs> I'm enjoying it, guys. I'm enjoying getting more organised and. Uh, than, than anything, probably to do it more enjoying more than doing the actual racing. But uh, I'm serious about borrowing stuff. I mean, anybody wants to borrow stuff, they're absolutely more than welcome. I just want it back at the end of the night, just bring it back, obviously, or uh, or for the start of the next meeting. So we've got back to the start, but it's obviously our spares. I've learned stuff out before, and it comes back during the week, it's great. But uh, I've learned stuff out before, and it comes back six months later, that's no good. So, uh, yeah, it's a serious offer. Right, I'm, uh, I'm not feeling very well, so I'm going to go and get a bath, and uh, feel better by the weekend. Right, I'm done. Right, it's Tuesday, we're getting ready for uh, for the weekend. And we've just ripped the door off. I put new new uh, rams on there because the door wouldn't have put properly. So I put some stronger rams on and it's ripped the door off. So Sean Blackmore was here, luckily, just finished off that trim. So Sean's took it away. I hope we get that fixed for the weekend. Well, we've got to. Can't get racing like that, can we? Right, if I cut that three off, I can nick his wing. Yep, that's what I'm going to do. Great. What a mess. Nothing's easy, is it? Oh, now I got to tidy that up. It's Wednesday and look what's just, just turned up. Our tyres. Bonus. Not bad fun, Jake. It's Thursday night and we're loading up and Jake's just uh, putting the truck away because we've been working on the coach and uh, now I'm going to drive my car because I haven't driven my car yet. So I, I, feel I felt terrible all week. Really, really poor. I've never felt so poor. I've not got COVID, I've had a couple of tests. But uh, I'm going to have another test before I leave for Saturday. But I need to cancel by tomorrow night, but I feel like it's tomorrow I can't go because I feel awful. So we're going to load up anyway and get ready anyway. Probably go anyway. And then if I, don't, if I feel like this on Saturday, I just won't race, but oh, we'll see. Right, let's go and get my car run because um, for the first time it's been out this season. And uh, make sure the brakes work, steering works, all that. Can't load up unless it works, shall we? Right, let's try it. Birthday. It's Jim's birthday. It's Jim's birthday. I don't know if she's going to come or not. But uh, it's our first day of the season. Uh, going to go and wake up now and uh, wish her happy birthday. Uh, I can't possibly tell you how old, how old she is. It's not really bad, is it? But uh, put it this way, she's a John Lund fan this year. <laughs> right, I feel a bit better, so uh, we'll be right. My, Jake's car's in. Just washing the coach, load mine, go some breakfast and uh, sort our kit out. And we're ready to leave about midday. See you there. Uh, the coach is our fault, so that's going to be what a grand for the deal. 200 quid for the petrol for the, for the cars, five, really five jerry cans of petrol. So, um, third pound of fuel, not sustainable, is it? Not sustainable. We're here, things are in, it's buzzing, it's busy, and we're back racing. Uh, we race one, twice the last 10 laps on front yellow side. Round the outside, Jake's in as well, Jake's got new tyres on. Jake's got new tyres on his car, he's back yellow, so good luck mate. See you out there. Uh, not good. I got up to second, I was going really good, and then the station car bounced across the track and I hit it. And it broke my uh, bolts, the bolt, bolt the, the bell house into the engine there. The bolts were snapped off in the engine, so we're going to try and do a quick repair if we can to get out of consolation. But, and Jake's engine doesn't sound good either, so... I think Jake's done for the night, he's done two laps, so oh, we're not good, we're good. Oh, I'll see if we can fix one and get another race out of mine yet. 
let's play first. Uh, consolation, I did half a lap and steering brake, and look at that, the boat makes the uh, arm off the steering. So, the end is broke off there. So, we're taking off the car now, and we're going to weld it back on and see if we can fix it. Do the commercial, try again. Well, that's the end of our day. Riding up with the pork lift, more steering's gone, Jack's engine's gone, all a lot of rubbish. Oh, I'll do it again next week, I suppose.